All right, today we're demonstrating the parallax effect. That's where it appears the background motion is moving faster than the subject at hand. And in this case, we're focusing on this clock at a shopping centre. So I've locked onto it there and using the free time telephoto zoom on the DJI Air 3. So we've locked on there. So using the spotlight function. So just always remember to press record. So I'm going to go slowly to the right. Not too slow because you want that motion blur. So just doing a, an orbit. And because we're in spotlight, it's locked on. Not going to lose uh, the subject in any aspect. So we're coming around almost completed 180 degree orbit. So we'll just press pause then. You notice that the subject has moved off, uh, the subject lock has moved off the clock a little bit, but it's still actually focused onto the clock itself. So we'll just get rid of that one, draw a rectangle over where you want to focus on. So there it is. And you'll notice how it's the big rectangle, but as I press the, the right joystick to move left and do the orbit, that little X will become like a GPS uh, symbol icon, and that way it won't move at all. So here we go. Press record. We're going to go left. We're going to go a little bit slower this time. And there we go, we've got that little GPS icon and it's locked on. So we're 24 metres up, just around about 40 metres away from the clock itself. But with the free time zoom, it just looks a lot better and the compression and the colour is fantastic. And once I get back to the editing um, part of it, this parallax, parallax um, feature will just look fantastic. It really makes the subject stand out and pop. And that's the parallax.